We're less than two weeks out from Thanksgiving, and now that Idaho has been rolled back to a modified stage two of its reopening plan, health officials are urging Idahoans to spend the holiday safely. Our Katia Sepovic has more. Thanksgiving will look a lot different this year as COVID cases continue to soar throughout the United States. I spoke to two families here in Idaho who say they're making sacrifices this holiday season in order to keep the community and their families safe. Family around the table and watching football and just uh, going for a walk. On a day usually spent sharing time and being grateful with all of the people you love. Uh, we'll Zoom, we'll do whatever it takes just to, you know, um, share a glass of wine over a video. This year, Cheryl Skinner of Boise will still be making all the fixings for her family. They'll just be enjoying them apart. I'm just going to make the Thanksgiving meal and package it up for them to come and pick it up um, in the garage. <laughs> Josh Kramer was born and raised in Boise. Unfortunately, his mother has cancer. So this year, the Kramer family will be playing it safe with no gatherings of over eight people. He says if we truly care about those closest to us, the sacrifice of distancing from them is worth it. Think about Thanksgiving and, and people coming together. We've got grandparents, you know, who are in their 80s. We've got great grandparents who are maybe even in their 90s. My own grandmother is, is you know, almost 90. and. Uh, COVID coming to a person like that is is life threatening completely. You know, it's basically a death sentence. Like many things 2020 has brought our way, this Thanksgiving too will be different. But Kramer and Skinner hope it will be for the best. There will be more Thanksgivings, you know, there will years to come. There will be more holidays. There will be more Christmases. You know, make the sacrifice this year, because if we make the sacrifice this year, we might not have to make it next year and that will be worth it. This is really kind of a first world problem worrying about sharing Thanksgiving. It's come on people. And even if your holiday celebrations might look a little different this year, I encourage everyone to try and find the best in their situation at hand. And of course, please, please stay safe and healthy. For a list of recommendations from Central District Health on how to safely celebrate this holiday season, you can visit our website, ktvb.com. In Boise, Katya Stepovic, Idaho's News Channel 7.